And there was life. <laughs> and there was still nothing, but now you can see it. Okay. And God saw that the light was good. And God separated the light from the darkness. God called the light day, and the darkness he called night. And there was evening, and there was morning, the first day. Then God said, let us make humankind in our image, according to our likeness, and let them have dominion over the fish of the sea, and over the birds of the air, and over the cattle and over all the wild animals of the earth, and over every creeping thing that creeps upon the earth. So God created humankind in his image. In the image of God, he created them, and made them male and female, he created them. God blessed them, and God said to them, Be fruitful and multiply, and fill the earth and subdue it and have dominion over the fish of the sea, and over the birds of the air, and over every living thing that moves upon the earth. God said, See, I have given you every plant yielding seed that is upon the face of the earth, and every tree with seed in its fruit, and you shall have them for food. And to every beast of the earth, and to every bird of the air, and to everything that creeps on the earth, everything that has the breath of life, I have given every green plant for food. And it was so. And God saw that everything that he had made was indeed, was very good. And there was evening. And there was morning. The sixth day. Okay, tiny animals are ready to be in the world. Ants say, yippee, yay! God says, okay, let's make the anteater now. Ants, what? And, and so it went, and the Lord said, seven days from now, I will send rain on the earth for 40 days and 40 nights, and will wipe from the face of the earth every living creature I have made. And Noah did all the Lord commanded him. Pairs of clean and unclean animals, of birds and of all creatures that move along the ground, male and female, came to Noah and entered the ark. <laughs> Next we have a unicorn. A oh, unicorn. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, excuse me, young lady. Uh, did you not read the casting call for this? It's two by two. Yes, you are. Goodbye! Oh. <laughs> oh. Well, come on, everyone! Come to me before! So Noah came out together with his sons and his wife and sons' wives. All the animals and all the creatures that move along the ground and all the birds came out of the ark, one kind after another. And then the Lord said, Never again will I curse the ground because of humans, and never again will I destroy all living creatures as I have done. Moses said, be not afraid, our Lord will pull us through. <laughs> Fighting the fight for us, but here's what we must do. Rise up, here come the mighty. Rise up, Moses and company. Rise up, parting the Red Sea. Rise up, leading his people free. Then Moses stretched out his hand over the Red Sea. The Lord parted the water so his people could flee. God sent an angel to put up a small screen, blocking out the Egyptians. Moses could proceed. The Egyptians pursued them, but to no avail. A horse and chariots, they were bound to fail. God was not on their side. Through the sea they would not pass. The waters swept over them. They were done alas. Rise up! Here come Almighty! Rise up! Moses and company, rise up! Parting the Red Sea, rise up! Leading the people free! Excuse me! Excuse me! Oh, hey!
How can I help you? Um, I just want to let you know, there's this lady that's out front, and she, it, you know, it's really unsafe. You guys are very busy today, and she's blocking traffic and kind of tying everyone up. Oh. Yeah, she's yelling at all the cars, talking about how we should value life and relish the truth. Well, if you're looking for uh, health and wellness stuff, you're going to find that down in uh, aisle 15. And if you're looking for relish, here, this one's on sale. Um, However, if you're looking for other relish, you can find it down in aisle 5. <laughs> No, no, no. Oh, look, there she is. She followed me in. Hi, how can I help you? Does all this work that you do, does that make you feel satisfied? Does the pay that you get really fulfill you? Does it give you a new life? If it doesn't, I have something worth more than gold and silver. Oh, I'm really sorry, madam, but we don't have any gold and silver coins anymore. <laughs> You just gotta go up to the uh, customer service desk over there and you can sign up for a silver savings card. That way, you get a gas discount and you get the savings. <laughs> oh, dear, dear, you do not understand. Let, let, me, let me try again. Because I'm really talking about how to live your life. Why don't you check out right now? Clock that ticket. Let's go. Come to dinner with me. I have prepared a lovely spread. Wait, wait, I get it. What you're talking about is that the comforts of life, that's what fills our body. But you're also talking about filling our spirit. Absolutely. You get it. And there are people like you looking for me. Come, follow me. I'll show you the way. God, please be merciful. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't you tell me all I had to do was tap on this and the whole story of Jonah was going to come up? Come on now. Yes, and if you get angry, ask Siri. <laughs> <laughs> Siri and I have hard ways. <laughs> that doesn't sound very kind, Mom. Look, all I want is to play the music on here and read the story of Jonah. And now I can't do it. I can't have shuffle. Where's the shuffle button anymore? And the people of Nineveh believed the word of the Lord as spoken by Jonah. They turned away from their sins and fasted and sought the Lord to have grace to them even to peace. And the king of Nineveh arose from his throne and laid aside his roll, royal robes and covered himself in sackcloth and sat in ashes as a sign of his sorrow. And the king sent out a command to his people that they should fast and seek the Lord and turn from sin. What's this got to do with my iPad? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not getting it. All right, I swear this is perfect. Hold on. That story you just read is all about becoming a better person while, yes, having to adapt and overcome these incredible struggles that God may or may not throw at you, depending on what you are. Throw at you, really. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And it's not what I meant. There's a lot of people. A lot of people make God angry. Uh, <laughs> are we going to the place? Yes. The iPad? Think about all the struggles that you've All the yelling at me you've gone through. All the looking up different articles online to see what the problem might be. All the looking at system settings to see if there's some magic switch to bring back your shuffle button, or the I want to mess Lin up button. There's all sorts of things in everybody's life, and that's what this story's about. About taking these challenges and making you a better person. <laughs> Take all those challenges and it reinforces you. It makes you more than what you were and makes you unique, unlike anybody else sitting in this room. Thank you.